AliciaKeysMasterclass.com. That's what we'll be talking about today. She teaches songwriting and producing. Uh, a bunch of things we're going to cover here. And if you take a look in the video description below, I have a bunch of other resources that I'm going to mention in this video as well. Uh, such things as Native Instruments, Alisa Keys, that's her sample library of her piano. Uh, Netflix Song Explorer, which is a Netflix show that features Alisa Keys on the first episode of season one, uh, or the volumes as they call them. That's a really good show too if you want to watch on some songwriting stuff, get behind the music and stuff like that. Other links include a resource page for songwriters. It's a songwritersclubhouse.org. All kind of books and stuff here, recommendations, videos for songwriting, lyrics and stuff like that. All kind of cool stuff going on there. Oh, this is the Alicia Keys uh, sound library I was talking about, Native Instruments. She mentions this in her masterclass as well. If you're familiar with music software, Native Instruments makes some of the really best stuff out there. And of course, they have a sample library of her, different things like that. Anyways, let's get back to uh, here. And I also have tons of other songwriting tips. Like that's the songwritingclubhouse.org. Also, some other classes on songwriting and music production that I've taken are the ones from Monthly. I have video re reviews on those as well. You can check them out. There's Ryan Tedder, there's Kygo, there's Blanks, there's Lewis Bell, there's Charlie Puth, uh, Andrew Wong. And I have discount codes for those as well. And if any time in the video you want to skip ahead, I have a timeline in this video as well. And also, I am a paying member of month or masterclass.com. And I also am an affiliate of them. So my link in the description below is an affiliate link. So if you do sign up with Masterclass from my link, I will make a small commission and no additional charge to yourself. And basically in her class, we're going to go over, um, uh, is it worth it? I'm going to go over the PDF that comes with the class. It's a workbooklet that you could download uh, and all the videos and stuff like that that she does. And then I'll give my final thoughts on it. And again, is it worth it? And then I'll talk about some of these other classes that I've, I've done as well at the end of the video here as well. So you can check those out. All right, so let's get into this masterclass.com as a whole first, because when you sign up for masterclass.com, you do get a, um, access to all of their videos, all of their lessons. And there's over a hundred right now. There's a bunch of other ones on music and production and artists. Let's go to this discover tab here. I've completed about 20 or so classes already, and they do have a bunch of, uh, I've done most, most of the music ones, not all of them yet, by the time you're watching this video, maybe. And all the classes come with a PDF workbook, uh, workbook. and at the time of making this video, there's a 30-day money-back guarantee from them as well. This is a really good, good one for designing your career. If, you know, if you're in the music business, this is not music per se, but it's just designing your career. Really good one in that as well that is finished power of storytelling, abstract painting and art and stuff like that. And here's some of the music ones I finished. Ukulele, producing and beat making with Timberland, electronic music production with Dead Mouse, electric guitar, Tom Morello, uh, St. Vincent, Questlove, Art and Negotiations, a real good one, non-music one, uh, photography as well that I did, uh, film scoring ones, a bunch of other stuff in here. So we have arts and entertainment, we have music, we have writing, we have food, business, design, style, sports and gaming, science and tech, home lifestyle, community and government, and wellness. So lots and lots of categories. So if you do decide to get the Masterclass membership, it's an annual membership. At the time I'm making this video, because it might change over the future, I believe in the past you had to pay for each Masterclass individually. But now it's an annual membership. It's about a little bit more than a Netflix membership. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And it's available for, you can watch it on your computer. There's an iOS app. There's an Android app. There's a Roku app. There's an Amazon uh, app as well. So you can watch it on any of these devices. And you can download videos for offline viewing as well. So a lot of really cool stuff. Uh, every class comes with its own PDF and community page, which we're gonna go into here with the Alicia Keys one. All right, so her PDF is 16 pages long. This one's kind of on the shorter side and there's no real tasks or anything. There's like a history and stuff like that. Um, a lot of good stuff like uh, history document, not documentary, but uh, what's it called? Information, some quotes and things like that. 
themes and variation. So you could read all through this. Some of the master classes have tasks and, and things to do. This one really does not. There's nothing to, they, they assign you or anything. So it's kind of more just a, you know, watch and learn kind of thing. And I'm not gonna go through the whole PDF here, but there's a lot of stuff in here. Uh, history and her, some of her influences and stuff like that. All right, so like I said, the PDF in this one's kind of shorter than the other ones, but let's take a look at the videos, an overview of the videos here. So as you can see here, Alicia Key teaches songwriting and producing. The legendary singer, songwriting and producer shares her approach to making music that resonates and helps you find the power of your unique voice. And there's three, it's three hours and 22 minutes and 19 videos. And if you scroll down here, you can download the workbook. There's a community down here as well that we could take a look at in a bit. We'll get into that in a second. Let's take an overview of the videos here and then I'll get into my thoughts and everything like that. Okay, so meet your instructor. I'm sure you're familiar with Alicia Keys at this point, but just a little bit of history of her. Uh, her found musical foundation and influences, six minute video on that. Then how she starts writing a song, starts with the melody and lyrics. She shares her methods and styles for developing lyrics. Now this is not a lyric writing course per se. There's a lot of other uh, courses out there on how to write lyrics and stuff like that. Um, that's one thing about this course. I find it's kind of more like a, you know, inspiration. It's kind of a lecture, inspiration, documentary, behind the scenes kind of thing. It's not necessarily teaching you like chord progressions and all that stuff. So I don't, you know, I don't know where you're coming at this from. If you're if you're interested in songwriting, if you're a beginner, if you're just looking for some inspiration, if you you know, uh, or just an Alicia Keys fan that you know just interested in watching her, you know, behind the scenes kind of stuff. Tell her her. You know process and things like that and then she talks about bringing it all together explains how fallen came together um in the songwriting process like that and what's interesting about this song is just two chords you know um she's a piano player obviously as well and she, you know she talks about how like you know as a musician that she likes to play a lot but this song was just so simple that you know as myself as a musician that likes to play you know all kinds of stuff sometimes a simple is just the better approach to it all right, connecting with the world around you. Uh, discover Leach's approach to using connection as a way to hone your creative voice. Ten minute video on that. Songwriting with empathy. Um, she just shows how to use empathy to create powerful music. Alicia Keys. Now, now we get into the producer part of it. Um, takes a look into our sound booth, and she discusses the roles she takes to, on to produce her distinct sound. Uh, and again. She mentions um, this. Uh, this is a program here that that is basically a sample library of her, one of her pianos, and sometimes she'll actually use this. She says so. I mean, she has the real piano, but so. But um, and I'm not going to play demos here because I might get copyright strikes or whatever. But you can check this out. There's a link in the video description below. It's made from Native Instruments. If you're familiar with them. Uh, vocal arrangement. She talks about the, uh, the strength of vocal and arrangement. She just put a lot of time into vocal arrangements. Um, obviously, being an awesome singer that she is, and singing all the background stuff and foreground stuff and all that stuff. Uh, build energy in the booth. You know, talks about developing physical, mental, emotional practices to take care of herself and her arts. Uh, and then she talks about anthems, kind of songwriting. And then she talks about radio, uh, retro futuristic sounds, you know, other instruments and things like that, and influ things that influenced her, her sound. And then we move into the alchemy of the control room, you know, more creative stuff. She uses a lot of different, you know, tools and stuff like that, synthesizers, you can't really see them here in the beatbox kind of thing. Um, instruments to boost your big sound. Uh, again, with more, more production stuff. And then she goes into a collaboration kind of stuff, talking about collaborating with people and then sisterhood in the music industry. And then there she's a uh, rising star spotlight. She kind of like uh, gives advice to a artist here through like a zoom call and then the power of purpose and then always be learning. So a lot of really jam packed stuff in here. I, I view this class as a, uh, it's like I said, it's more like documentary behind the scenes kind of like lecture kind of thing. It's not 
it's not necessarily a class on how to write a song per se. Like there's no like, you know, one, four, five chord and use this chord progression and kind of stuff. But it's very interesting, I would say indeed. And it kind of rem reminds me of the, 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 the Netflix special too, where they just talk about how to create a song. This, I recommend watching these two. I watched uh, all, there's only two volumes out at the moment. They have like Trent Reznor on here and REM and a bunch of other people. So overall, you know, I would say, is, is this worth it? Here's the thing about Masterclass. If you're interested in one class, you know, I don't necessarily think it's worth it to, to get a whole membership for just one class, but there's so much stuff on here that's related to the same kind of class, if you will. Like there's a bunch of music ones and there's, you know, I have a bunch of different interests and I've watched over 20 of these ones already and now there's, I haven't even scratched the surface. There's a lot of cooking ones I haven't watched yet that I want to get into. I think it's really cool. It's, it's like I said, it's not necessarily a how to write a song class. You know, there's lots of songwriting courses out there. But if you're an Alicia's Key, Alicia's Key, I can't even talk. Alicia Keys fan, or if you just, you know, if you're not even, you, it's 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 worth it's worth it's worth watching. Um, a lot of really cool stuff, and um, so let's take a look at the community here as well. Uh, these I don't really get too much involved in on the community pages, but they're they're here, and I've you know asked questions and introduced myself and did things on other ones. It's a little bit self-promoting and stuff like that but you can check this out this is like you know part of their deal here and you could do the workbook there that's the pdf i showed you earlier and you can just go in here and you know connect with people if you want to pretty cool feature i don't use it that much to be honest with you but it's there um so anyways let's talk about some other music production classes that i've taken that are really cool and those are the monthly ones a monthly.com and I have discount links down below. I'll just talk about one of them because they all kind of overlap. For example, Ryan Tedder's monthly class. His those the monthly classes are more like immersive. They're like a 30 day um, thing that you do and you do tasks every day and you write music. Let's actually go to the site here. You produce and write a song with Ryan Tedder or the other artist. I'm doing the vocal one here too. Uh, these are all the ones I've taken on here. Charlie Puth. Louis Bell, Blanks, Kygo, uh, Ryan Tedder. So, for example, you know, I did this a while ago, earlier this year, but he goes into in depth his process. You kind of emulate his process and then you upload yours to get feedback on it and stuff like that. Not from him, from the other people in the peer, there's like 20 people in your peer group. Although it says that he will pop in every now and then, I didn't see him the time I taken it. I did see a video of him on YouTube going over songs from his class and he gave some feedback. So these are kind of 30 day collaborates things, or not collaborate things, but uh, intense kind of things. And In his class you do three songs, two of them you do by yourself and then one he does a collaboration with another artist. So these are really cool too, if you want to check them out. I recommend both. I did a video. A, a, on uh, monthly class monthly.com versus masterclass.com as well um, you can check that out but there's a lot of really cool in-depth stuff in here as well so there's a link for that as well in the video description below monthly.com versus masterclass don't the, just the music courses so anyways if you have any questions um, please leave them in the comments below and by the way month masterclass.com as well has a 30-day money-back guarantee so if you want to sign up, and of course that's the time I'm making this video. I always want to put, throw that in this video because it might change by the time you get there or whatever or you're watching this. So overall, like I said, there's a lot of really cool stuff in her course. It's more like a documentary, inspirational insight into her world, if you will. And it's really cool. So check it out. Let me know if you have any questions. That is all for now, and I will talk to you soon.